Welcome back viewers. This is a continuation from my last video on where I had a faulty fridge controller on a brass monkey fridge. The controller has failed and I've tested the board and it's the MCU that's failed. There's a dead short between VDD and VSS which is pin 1 and pin 3. VSS is pin 3. Uh, yes, so these are programmable chips on a probably 8051 architecture. I do not have the program to upload to a new chip so and I don't have a programmer so therefore this board is unrepairable for me. Uh, the program that's probably loaded onto the chip is probably a trade secret for whoever made the board, the Brass Monkey. There is no way to source that code but I have found that these fridges are almost identical, well they pretty well are identical, to these fridges on AliExpress. Now you can actually buy a board for $44. It looks all, almost identical, it may actually work. Whether it's worth the risk of buying one, I don't know. It may not be quite compatible. The fridge is actually a good price, but the shipping is not a good price. At $183 to ship to Australia, that's not good at all. Although the price for the fridge itself is very competitive for what's available for a brass monkey here. So, that's the end of this video. Thank you for watching anybody who was out there.